Okay, I'm here. I'm with one of my best friends ever in the world, and y'all all recognize him. Shooter Jenny. Oh my God, man. So good to see it you. It's so good man. to see you. Oh, man, how long has it been now? Oh uh, man, it's been over a year. Over it's been a year. Out since John. I mean, wow. Yeah, we got my the man. Manager, my manager, Adam, over here. The new manager. Yeah, the man. That the, well, introduce uh, him. Yeah, Adam. Adam's, uh, Adam went on the road with my dad's band. Uh, well, I mean, while I was touring with the Waymore's Outlaws, that's where we kind of met again. But his da his grandfather played in my dad's band, and as a kid, he was around. And I, he's younger than me, you know. So he was he was younger than me, but he was around when we were growing up. When when the when the Colonel passed away, we, you know, I knew there was nobody better to take over than Adam because him and me and the Colonel were like yeah. a unit, you know. So if everybody knew the Colonel, it's Colonel John Hensley. He passed away. He was like. His, his, his manager, his best friend, John was like my best friend. John would call me pretty much every night. We would talk. And he's very much missed. Very much missed. Part of our family, man. Part of the Anchor Grandpa. He brought us together. Yeah, he absolutely did. His brilliance of sending you that package. John, you know, Kurt, the Colonel <laughs> brought Shooter and I together. So. Nobody he loved more than Anchor Grandpa. We will never <laughs> forget John, That's the right. Colonel. That's right, we will never forget the Colonel. So you're back in Charleston, you're doing another short at the Poor House. Doing another Poor House. Last time you threw a big fit in the damn sound check there. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. That was funny, man. And the guys in the Waymore's band were like, who the hell is he and why is he yelling at everybody? <laughs> yeah, I know. That was so <laughs> funny. Oh, man. And here we are back again, reunited. But you know, I got something for you. Yeah? Uh, I, I want you to make sure you get all this. About... Three weeks before John, Colonel John did left us, all right? You know, he was he had his jukebox. Yeah. And he was always looking for new music for it. Yeah. And the Colonel was always into the old 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, that yeah. era. So I found these, and I can't think of a better person to give them to. Oh, man. Than you. Because you got the same buff look with the music we got. Oh, man, look at this. Holy These are old twenties, thirties. Holy shit, man. And I can't think of a better person I'd rather have these and trust these to than you. Oh my lord, man, thank you so much. How cool are these? Eddie Arnold. Oh, John It's got that old love. song, Oh My Papa. Hank Snow. Oh yeah, look at that, man. They go way back. I, I mean he would have loved Webb Pierce, he would have he would have eaten that shit up, man. Wow. I just couldn't think of anybody I'd rather have them than yeah, you because... I will treasure these, man. I will treasure because these. According to the Colonel, you love the music just as much as we did. Well, I want to get you to sign on the inside of one. That's no problem. I love that, man. Wow, look at that. Pee Wee King. Oh, wow. They go oh, back. Man, thank you so much. Thank you so much for that. That means so much to me, man. Me too. It means so much to me. Those are so... I have had them, and I've had them, and I've been wondering, you know... I mean, this like little case and everything is wild, man. I've never seen anything like those. Look at that, Eddie Fisher. Wow, man. That is special. That means the world to me that you'd pass it to me. Yeah, I couldn't think of anybody better. Man, I mean, he would have lost his mind over something. Yes, I can see him. I can, I can see him in his jukebox now. Yeah, he'd be, <laughs> at, it. He'd be at it, plugging him in. Oh wow, Al Jolson! I mean, look at that. That's a really. Like I say, you got some twenties and thirties and forties. Oh, I'm gonna put these on, and get drunk one night. And, there you go. And I'll film it and send it to you. Do that. Yeah, man. Look at that. <coughs> Jim Nash, Franklin, Kentucky. Man, there's some great records in here, man. What a wild collection! Thank you so much, man. I love it. Thank you, man. So I couldn't much. Think of anybody better. Wow, I'm man. Well, that means a lot to me, for sure.